¿Qué onda mis amigos y amigas? Hello and how are you all doing? For my uh, English only uh, understanders. Um, Viva la raza. I am of course Hispanic. My name is Kawil. And I'm bringing you here some action of the um, the ultimate fail of yours truly in this game called Battlefield 3. Now, th this is all one rush match. Um, and, and you know, normally you guys, I play Conquest. But I, if y you guys know about Conquest and the consoles, 12 on 12, these maps are too huge for 12 on 12 in Conquest. I mean, they just are. Uh, I don't even want to think about what it's going to be like in the new Armored Kill DLC, which I'm on the fence about actually getting. I like I like the vehicles and stuff like that. But I mean, can you imagine playing freaking Conquest on 12v12? You know, on those maps, those huge-ass maps? I wouldn't see anybody. I'd just be dicking around in a, in a mountaintop somewhere, behind a rock, in a building, wherever. And, uh, you know, I'd see somebody and I'd want to, you know, I'd take them out for coffee or something because I hadn't seen them for two hours. So, uh, like I said, I, I, I switched it up. I'm, I'm running some Conquest. I mean, excuse me, not Conquest. I'm running some some Rush because the action is a little bit, is, 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 is more action. Uh, and, of course, when there's more action, I tend to do that, which is die a lot. <laughs> yeah, I, die, I die so many times. My KD is, is roughly around one. You know, I suck at this game, guys. What can I tell you? Uh, I am the loo I am the noob leading the noob. What can I tell you? Uh, yeah. Uh, I, I don't know these maps. I'm trying to learn them. Um, so I switched off to Rush. I'll give you guys a little bit more action. And this is all one Rush match, which we end up losing in the end. Uh... I'm not going to explain to you how Rush works because if you're watching this video, you obviously understand how, the, you know, how this freaking game works. And if you don't, well, just keep watching and you'll learn. Hello, Mr. Tanky. Oh. Um, if you've watched my BF43 videos, you you kind of understand that, or you come to understand that I'm kind of like a tank killer. Um, whether that be me on foot killing a tank. Or that me being in a tank killing a tank. So, and I forgive the fail here with the buttons. I'm trying to figure out how to reload and get the right weapon. And and, and then, you know, I, I, yeah. There you go. I got it. 50 years later, the old man got it, all right? So get off my ass about it, all right? So, um, I, I, I took out the boring parts of this. Because the boring parts of this is me running around like I was just doing, running around. Uh, and this is a complete fail. I have no idea where this guy went. I guess this is him right here. And then his boy comes out and shoots me in the face. Yeah, that's why you should never go for the knife. You should just shoot him. You should just shoot him! Um, oh yeah, speaking of tanks, I get in this tank. And I just gonna let you right know right now that it's a long way up to that next set of MCAMs. So what I do here is I, you know, I cut. I'm the director, so I said cut. And then you'll see me up at the very top. And I'm gonna go try. I'm gonna, uh, on this next part right here. I'm gonna go and try. I'm gonna go and try. I'm gonna try and go through this wall right here, right? And forgive me. You see it. You see to the left right there that the wall is open. But I'm such a freaking noob that I gotta break the wall and go through it. And then I'm like, holy shit, I could have gone right around. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah, like I said, noob leading the noob. But that's fine. I'm here for your pleasure. I'm here for your entertainment. If my deaths bring anything to you, folks. Whether that be ridicule, whether that be laughter, whether that be, oh my god, I can't believe he just did that. You know, then I've done my job. I've, I've done my job. Um, 
Yeah, so I'm gonna roll around a tank and I kill some people and eventually I die, which of course is what happens in BF3 is you die a lot. Me, of course, I die more than the normal average soldier because, you know, I suck! And that's okay. So back back to Rush. Uh, I enjoy the Rush games. Um, like I said, there's more action. Uh, I just basically have to figure out the maps because I haven't played this game much. Um, I'm trying, I'm trying to like the game for the actual gameplay and it's really gorgeous. It is really beautiful. The gameplay is, is, is good, all right? The gameplay is not, the, the controls, I'm talking about the controls, they're not as tight as I would like them to be. Um, you, you tend to move around a lot when, when you're scoping in the guns. And it's just, it's, it's just difficult. The sensitivity is really giving me some problems in this game. I will admit that. Um, it's not tight like BF43. I mean, it's really tight in BF43. Excuse me. And in this game, the, they're it's tight, but it's loose at the same time. And it's just hard to get used to. And I'm complaining for absolutely no reason because, you know, you guys are young. You, <laughs> you don't need the old guy telling you that this stuff is hard. Because you guys, you guys are late. You know, 1337, you guys are late. Hardcore. Me, I'm just rolling around a tank trying not to die. Which is, of course, why I'm rolling in around in a tank trying not to die. But uh, I just want to let you know, guys, that I'm going to try and bring you some more videos of BF3. Uh, I already have, since I started this game, um, since I've really started to, to start playing it, I've gotten better. I mean, you know, you kind of you kind of do get better. I'm not going to call myself anywhere anything like a player. I'm merely fodder for you guys out there to shoot wound and kill and blow up Freaking jerk off. that guy that guy was all over my ass this whole game I hate him I hate him no I don't hate him I don't hate him I don't hate him um so uh BF43 that's my game um and the reason it's it's my game is because I think I'm pretty decent at it you know I'm decent at it. This game I'm trying to really get good at. And I love you guys. I, mean, I really love you guys. I'm trying to bring you some entertaining... Entertaining. Some entertaining videos to watch. <laughs> I really am. It's just so hard. It's, just, it's just killing me all the time. I can't get the time to do it. I'm sorry, guys. Anyway, I've picked up my big girl panties. They are now firmly wrapped around my waist and around my head. I have two pairs. Uh, I have, you know, straightened out my skirt. No more crying. There's no crying in Battlefield. Um, but I'm going to try and bring you guys some good gameplay. You know, what can I tell you? I really have nothing else to talk about. For this whole thing because it's just basically me dying all over the place I died and died and died and I actually do get this guy back because I hate getting knifed I, and you know the, the, and he's off to the left that I saw him there he is you know it you should you should not let this game you shouldn't let this game get to you like that I mean you shouldn't take it personal because these you know I mean you're going to see this person for maybe 10 minutes, 15 minutes during the game. And then you're probably not going to see that person, you know, for a while. Whatever. Yeah. See, you can't really take this game personal when it comes to stuff like that. But when you get stabbed in the back, you know, it's like, how can you not take that? Per I mean, you know, you got your conies, you know, right there. You got your conies, you got your, 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 your golden power bars or have what, you know, Big Jim and the twins sitting there. You know, and, and, and you get knifed in the back. And you know what happens to Big Jim and the Twins? They shrink! They shrink because your manhood has been crunched. It's crunched. 
and then taking it in the fist and then crunching it. And it just gets so fucking pissed. Oh! So, yeah. How was that rant? Was that rant good enough for you guys? Did you, did you like that? Did you like me getting upset? I didn't get upset. But, uh, you know, like I said, you shouldn't take this game personal. And I'm speaking from, you know, I'm not really talking to you guys when I say that. I'm talking to myself. But, you know, sometimes you just got to have to go. You got to have, you got to go after the guy that knifed you in the back. I mean, and if you can get him in the back as well, <laughs> that's really freaking good. <laughs> yeah, that's good. I, I don't know why I looked down. I, <laughs> I know why I looked down because I couldn't see him because the damn pistol was right in my face. And so I looked down and I, I shot him in his feet. I shot his knees out from under him. And here we go, fail again with the buttons. Yeah, I, I just don't know what the buttons do. So, um, yeah, we're coming here pretty close to the end of this demolishing that we get. I mean, I die like over and over. And, you know... I run around back here trying to trying to kill some people because I mean if you look at the tickets it's only 12 we got 12 left and um, there's only one there's only one MCOM left and with my team the way they are we're just not gonna we're just not gonna win they're all just kicking back right there and, and then kind of just you know handing us our ass on a silver platter and that was a fail toss but uh, I get a I get a cheap kill here and then you know I do what I do best is I die. Yeah. Um, but guys, I just want to let you know that uh, more footage is coming. I got this one coming uh, today or tomorrow. I got some more BF3 stuff coming. I gotta edit it, throw some commentary on it, you know. And look at that, uh, 19 and 17. Eh, eh, not bad, not good. But anyways, got anyway, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Please enjoy, comment, rate, whatever you want to do, and have a good day.